The first step in RNA extraction is to lyse the sample, and essentially kill the virus. Basically, we are tearing it apart and releasing the nucleic acid so we can purify it. What you see here is magnetic bead-based extraction. The beads bind to the nucleic acid and the magnet pulls the beads out of solution, which purifies the sample. When the old solution is washed away, we are left with RNA. Next, we turn the RNA into cDNA, which makes the sample more stable. RNA is single-stranded and has a very short life. DNA is double-stranded, so it holds up better nature. We turn RNA into cDNA by adding a master mix of random hexamers and enzymes that cling to spots on the RNA and amplify it. Once that's done, we have cDNA and the sample is ready to go into PCR. PCR stands for polymerase chain reaction, and it amplifies cDNA by turning one strand into millions of strands. What we are doing is amplifying a specific viral family so that it is easier to determine if it is in the sample. The primers we use are specific for the genetic code of the virus we are looking for. When the PCR gets going, the forward primer will extend one way and the reverse primer will extend the other way, creating two more strands. Through a process of heating and cooling and heating and cooling, the primers will bind and then the TAC enzyme will start filling in the A, T, C's and G's. That's how amplification leads to exponential growth. When PCR is done, we add dye to the samples and put them into the wells of a gel. Then we run a current through the liquid and the samples separate based on their size. For example, something that's 200 base pair, like herpes virus, will go through the gel a lot faster than something that's 600 base pair, like filo virus. After the gel has been run, we look at the results under the fluorescence of a UV light and take a photo with a special camera so that the results can be documented and analyzed. If we have some positive samples, we often purify them and send them off for sequencing to learn the exact genetic makeup.